Hey everyone, and welcome to the channel. Now, let's get into the video. Travis Landon Barker is an American drummer who's a member of the rock band Blink-182. He's also worked with hip-hop musicians often. Being a member of the rap rock band Transplants, founding the rock bands Plus 44 and Boxcar Racer, and then joining Antimask and Goldfinger. Now, let's look at the shocking reason why Travis Barker moved to Calabasas. But before we begin, be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any of our future videos. Number 5. Barker moved to Calabasas to be closer to Courtney. Travis Barker was smitten with Courtney Kardashian even before they began dating, and he just revealed that he relocated to Calabasas to be closer to her. According to Kris Jenner, the Blink-182 drummer purchased his property a block away from the Poosh founder because he felt she was the one for him. On episode 5 of The Kardashians, Jenner informed Kardashian about the discussion. Do you want to know why he relocated to Calabasas for real? Jenner inquired of her oldest child. I just felt I could live beside her if I couldn't date her or be with her because she was with someone else, he said. I've never met a greater person in my life, like the thoughtfulness and just everything. Kardashian remarked of Barker after hearing her fiancé's remarks to her mother. Number 4. Barker's First Home in Calabasas Barker is said to have purchased his first property in Calabasas 15 years ago, in 2007, one year after his divorce from Shanna Mokler, and a second home in the region in 2017. He and Kardashian had been friends for a long time, but they just started dating last year. They're now engaged, and the mother of three says she's thinking about buying a house together. Travis and I presently reside in different houses, a block apart from each other, Kardashian claimed on an episode of The Kardashians. She went on to say that they would explore the concept of living in one house. They were seen in Bel Air looking at a property and making out all over the furnishings. Number 3. Dating History of Travis and Courtney The Blink-182 drummer tells Us Weekly about his crush on Courtney's sister, Kim Kardashian, whom he met when he was dating Paris Hilton years prior. How could you not stare at Kim, he said at the time. Mind you, I enjoyed hanging out with Paris, but I love curvy girls. Kim was eye candy. I was no way disrespectful to Paris, but I couldn't keep my eyes off Kim. He even claims Kim came to him for advice when she was approached by Ryan Seacrest with the original idea for keeping up with the Kardashians. I think my family is interesting and it could be something, he recalled Kim saying. I gave her the best advice I could. In February 2019, Courtney and Travis sparked dating rumors when they were spotted grabbing dinner in Malibu. Though it's been reported the two have been friends for years, it's worth noting that they both live in the same gated community in Calabasas. And the drummer even appeared on KUWTK and Cocktails with Chloe. Number 2. Year 2021 for Travis and Courtney January 2021. Fans speculate after Travis responded to one of Courtney's mirror pictures with a rose emoji, a mermaid emoji on another, and said, You're so awesome, on yet another. When each of them shared images from the same hang at Kris Jenner's Palm Springs house, the buzz grew exceptionally. Courtney and Travis had a platonic connection for years, a source told Entertainment Tonight. They've been friends and family friends for a very long time. Something happened recently and their connection has grown passionate. February 2021 is when the real party begins. On February 17, the couple will make their Instagram debut. Travis evidently enjoys emojis, as seen by his red heart remark on this one. Travis goes from emoticons to gushing about his love on the Drew Barrymore show in March 2021. I'm spending time with a wonderful mother, a wonderful friend, and you don't have to worry about any of those things. Barker told Barrymore, It simply happens naturally, like a maturation process. On March 27, Courtney and her boyfriend will attend an MMA match in Vegas with actress Megan Fox and her twin flame, rapper Machine Gun Kelly. Number 1. Courtney and Travis are one of the best romantic couples. Sometimes the best romances start off as friendships, while Courtney Kardashian and Travis Barker's new relationship may come as a surprise to many, the pair have known each other for years. After Barker spent time with Kardashian at her mom Kris Jenner's Palm Springs, California home in January 2021, Us Weekly confirmed that the pair were dating. Courtney and Travis are officially a couple, the insider told us. They have been close friends for years and have been dating for a couple months. Travis is very smitten with Courtney and has been for a while. Shortly before the dating news broke, the Blink-182 drummer left multiple flirty comments on the Poosh founder's Instagram posts. As she shared a steamy selfie from her closet, Barker commented with a rose emoji. He dropped a mermaid emoji beneath a pic of her walking into the ocean. He also wrote, You're so cool, after she shared screenshots of the 1993 film True Romance. The rocker has previously stated that True Romance is his favorite movie. 
He even named his daughter after Patricia Arquette's character, Alabama. Since the pair both live in Calabasas, they would casually get together sometimes. We would go out to eat, just hang out, he said, noting that he had a crush on her, and we were flirtatious, but nothing ever happened. They proved to be the best romantic couple in many aspects. This end from now on. With that, we come to the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell so you don't miss out on future videos. If you enjoyed the content, then do leave a like. So until next time, take care and goodbye.